everybody, welcome back to my channel. So, I am filming this haul on Monday. Normally I save everything up and film every Thursday, but all of this arrived today and I got really excited and I really want to use it, so I don't want to wait till Thursday. <laughs> so, I've decided to film this and if anything else comes, I will film more and add it on. Um, yeah. Stuff is really starting to come in from my uber spending. Anyway, so I'm going to start with the Simply Gilded sub box, which took forever to get here. It's the first one I had shipped direct to me instead of to my mall box, and I had to pay customs on it, which is a bit disappointing. I believe if you don't get the add-on washi, you don't pay customs. So I did sort of um and ah about that, but I do like the add-on washi, so I'll probably just suck it up and accept that I have to pay extra. So the box is Park Avenue. Oh, that's so cute. Okay. Um, okay. So there is a journaling card, which is adorable. I love the pattern. There is a B6 notebook, which that's the front. Very sweet. There's no thing telling me what everything is this time. Weird. Oh well. Uh, there is a pe the pen. I really like this plaid pattern. This tartany type pattern. I really like this. It's really cute. There is a key fob. Very sweet. Sticky note. I like those. They're really pretty. The foiling is good. Oh, I wonder if this is the mystery item. I don't know because there's no sheet telling me what's in it. Have I just missed the sheet? Wait a minute. No, it's not in there either. Oh, it's stuck in the box. Look. <laughs> okay, yeah. Foiled journaling card. Yes, this must be the mystery item and it is a card holder. Oh, I actually really like this. And will probably get use out of this. Ooh, ooh, like it. Uh, <clears throat> there's the sticker book. The vegan leather sticker book. It's very cute. I do like these sticker books in this size. I do use two of them on a day-to-day -day basis, and I will probably add this one into that rotation. See, this one doesn't have the sticky feel that the last one I bought did, which is nice. Then there's, oh, come on, the stickers. So, there are foiled dates and icons. More dates and icons. They're pretty, I like the matte of those. There's the half box, full box, and checklists. There's the seals, they're pretty. I like those. And there is the header, the date covers, full boxes, checklists. I am definitely using this kit. This is so pretty. I might use this next week in my Stalogy. That would look nice. And then there's the washi. I don't know why I sang that. I just did. Oh, I like the bag. I wonder if I could do something with the bag. I bet I could. So, there's loads. Whoa, there's so many, I can't hold them. Okay, we have skinny bows, the tartan houses. I will unroll these and show you. More bows and the add-on. See, I'm glad I get the add-on. I like the add-on. So I'm gonna show you these unrolled right now. So here is the washi. That one has got that sort of glitter effect. 
Oh, that one I did not cut well at all, did I? Look at that. <laughs> the bows, I like the bows. They're pretty. And the filing's really good. The houses are really cute as well. Mm. Next up is a Once More with Love order. If you watched my haul from last week, you'll know that some of these are duplicates. I forgot that I bought some of them. I won't lie. I didn't bother looking at my old order and then I did another Halloween order and I got myself all confused. So... <laughs> Yeah. Um, so the postcard says, light the way for others, the best people help other people shine. That's nice, I like that. Okay, so yeah, there's some doubles, just go with me. So there's the August freebie. There's the Nightmare Before Christmas, that's definitely one that I already ordered, and I ordered two this time. Oh well, you can never really have enough. Uh, you Rang, which I also ordered those last time. Peekaboo Ghosts, love those. Halloween countdown. I did order two, another one of those on purpose. I remembered I ordered that, but I wanted one for my other planner. More movie boxes, which I already ordered. More horror movie characters I ordered. More Halloween deco that I ordered. More schoolhouse that I'd already ordered. Some hot tubs. These are to put aside for next year. We've had to put our hot tub away now because it's getting a bit chilly. -er. It's actually not today, but we're not likely to use the hot tub again this year. Homeschool chalkboard. Love this. Love the different expressions on the munchkin's face as well. Halloween stamps which I already bought. Ugg season because I love my Uggs and I love the munchkin in Uggs. The watch scary movies. Haunted house scene. Love that. So cute. I bought two of those. Of course. The skull and bones banner. Love. And the Hocus Pocus fold over spell book because I love fold over stickers. And then this was the main reason for placing the order. I can't believe how many I ordered without realizing I'd already ordered them. Oh well. So this is the kit, the Hey Boo kit. So there's some functional and some boxes. There is full boxes. Once More With Love doesn't very often do kits, so when she does, I want them. Love those headers. And the bottom washi is amazing. I'm gonna use this in my cousin, I think. And I'm gonna put that at the top and that at the bottom because they're just so cute. Super cute. So that's my large and possibly potentially silly order from Once More With Love. But you know what? You can never have too many Halloween stickers. That's what I'm telling myself and that's what we're sticking with. Okay. Next up is a lot from Some Little Things. So I got two separate packages, this one and this one. This one includes my subscription because you can bundle one order in with a subscription order. And this is the one I did. So this is the older one. So I'm gonna do this first. This was a bundle that I purchased I'm trying to remember when it was. It was delayed because of the Lil Plushie. She was delayed um, at customs for ages. And they gave you the option to not wait for her, but heck, I was waiting for her. She's so cute. Look, look how cute she is. Is it the summer bundle? I'd have to double check. And she's a key ring as well. I mean, really, you can't really go wrong with that. She's probably just gonna sit though on my shelf rather than be a key ring for me. She's a bit big for a key ring for me, to be honest. So, oh, it's so cute. Okay, this was, yeah, this was the Lil Summertime Collection Bundle. So, I'm really excited about this. To be honest, I'm always excited about some little things orders, but I'm real excited. So, there's a tiny acrylic block there, which will tell you one of the items. <laughs> so I don't believe the bundle is available anymore, but I think there might be some of the products from the bundle are still available. You would have to check on the website. But there is 
a little sheet of stickers, which are thank you stickers, which are super cute. As always. I mean, little stuff is just adorable. These little ice cream seals. I think I'm going to save quite a few of this, so the Summer Bliss postcard. I'm going to save these for next summer. So this is the little card that it comes with, packaged in, which tells you meet the little misfits. So there's this key ring. This one I think I will put on my keys. I love this little one. That is super cute. Then there is the freebie, which is the August freebie. And then there's the stickers. So there's this one, which is Lil Summer Bliss. There's this one. The foiling is that holographic like shatter. Can you see the picture though? See the characters are all foiled on top. Love it. Checklist and a week tracker. I knew what I was trying to say there. That just did not come out there. <laughs> uh, some more full boxes and some washi. I mean that foil is showing up really nicely on camera. So cute. Weekend banner and some headers. Date covers and boxes. Then you get some more checklist boxes. These are on the matte paper. The other ones were on the vinyl. They're really sweet. I like the color blocking of these. If I used a vertical that was the right size, these would be really nice for like day to day. There's the deco dolls, which I'm sorry, but these are just adorable. <laughs> and there's Lil playing on the beach. Building her little sand castle. I love that it's like a series. So there's her starting to build and then having to tip the crab out of the bucket. So sweet. And Peking Lil's, which if you watched my Stylogy plan with me, the last one, last one or the one before, um, I'll link it in a card up here. But I made a little tab out of this Lil, a Lil from a different sheet. No, it came out so cute. They make such cute tabs. Um, so there is another little card as well, Belief in Yourself. Love that. And then there are stamps, which is why I got the acrylic block as well. I mean, you can never really have enough acrylic blocks, if I'm honest. It does have that paper on it, so. I'll need to get that off. Um, but I like that it was teeny tiny as well. And I just thought they were so cute. And it has all the days of the, all the months of the year. No, it doesn't. It has June, July and August, so just the summer. But I just thought they were really sweet and I really like the little ones, so. I will find a way to use them. Somehow. <laughs> Probably next summer. And then there is, oh, ah, yeah. These are the washies that came in the bundle. So there's this one, there's skinny ones, and then there's these sticky leaf ones. They're gonna be really delicate and peel off. I will unroll these and show you them. And then also in the bundle, I, if you watched my haul, I'll link in a card here. I was missing two rolls of washi from an order. I got sent double of a different one. And so they sent me the ones that I was missing, which are these ones, which are the gems. And I love the colors. So pretty. So they were included in this order as well. So that is the summer bundle. These ones are sticker flakes. So it's not like one roll of washi, which I quite like. And those are the washies. So that's the gem ones. Those are the ones that were missed from my last order. They're really pretty. I like that greeny color. Then, <laughs> so then we have my subscription. I think it's July. Okay, this is the August subscription, and this is the bakery. Oh my goodness! Okay, so, uh, Callon and Lil have sent me a little note attached to my order, and they have given me a code for you guys to use. Oh, 
how exciting. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, so if you use the code HONEY10, you'll get 10% off your order. So I'm going to leave the code up. I'll leave a link down below with all the details, but that will give you 10% off your order. Thank you so much, Callon and Lil. I love that Lil <laughs> sent me the code. Thank you. That Oh, that's really nice. I love it. Love it. Okay, so anyway, let's go back to the actual delivery. So we have the August subscription, which I am very excited about the subscription. That to the side. <clears throat> I am excited because of trying to make sure I get the right things. Okay, I've worked it out, sorry. That was actually included with the other order. So this is the subscription for August. So there are these four washi tapes, which are clear tapes. I'm gonna unroll them because you cannot see what they are. So I'll unroll them and insert that at the end or just so here. So the August clear tapes, I don't know if you can call them washi, but they don't tear using my washi cutter. I had to cut them with scissors, but they are really cute. The foiling is really good, so I do really like those. Then there are these bubble stickers. Now these stickers are designed to decorate the notebook. So this is the pouch this month, which does fit into an A5 planner. And this little pocket book is a monthly planner. It has tracker page. Oh, I think that could be for online orders maybe. It has a monthly. And then it has these daily timed. Or is that weekly timed? Sorry. No, daily timed. That is super cute. And the sticker is to decorate as well. So that is really sweet. I like that a lot. Hmm. wonder what I could use that for. Hmm. Anyway... So, I get the Hobonichi kit and the generic sticker kit. So, here's the Hobonichi kit. I love the little date dots. So, these sheets are on vinyl and they are foiled, beautifully foiled. I love Nono with the little chef's hat on. That's got to be my favourite thing ever. Um, some boxes and checklists. Again, on vinyl and foiled. Another sheet. Then you have the non foiled. Whoops. And then you also get the monthly, which is awesome. I am going to start using these. I haven't used any of them yet, but I'm going to use them in my weeks next year. So. I'm sort of saving them up for that. And then the generic sticker kit. These are on vinyl and foiled. Life is what you bake of it. These are in rose gold foil, which is showing up much better on camera, I have to say, than the hollow. Checklists and the week banner headers and a weekend flag banner more checklists and a whole bunch of washi the foiling is really pretty tiny little toasted buns which are date covers and little faces can you even oh my goodness they're so cute some deco sheets no no with the chef's hat is just what's gonna win it for me um Little Chinese, little toasted buns, Chinese bakery. Okay. Ah, I know what a Portuguese egg tart is. That's a pastel de nata. Apart from that, egg tart. Yeah. Then I have moods. Cute. The bakery. I love this little one. It's so sweet. And then more bakery. And then the dividers. I like the dividers. I really like the dividers in the generic sticker kit. They're really cute. 
And then, saving the best for last in this kit. I can hear my child crying, by the way. I might have to go in a second. But this, I'll have to take the bits off. This sticks to here, like this, it just sits in here. I can hear my child screaming. <laughs> and it is a washi tape holder. So you just slot your washi tape on and then put the base back on and it stands up like that with your washi tape stacked up. I love that. I hope they bring out more designs of that because I'm gonna want more of that one. Because that is too cute. Too cute. Then I have this order, which this, I'm gonna find the information. So this is the bundle of back to school session bundle. Um, this, I don't think the bundle is available. I'm sure it's sold out but I think some of the products are still available. So I also ordered zombie washi tape, which I will unroll and insert a bit here. That is the zombie one, I love it. Love that Nono's hiding under like a tub. It's so cute. <laughs> but this uh, washi tape I ordered separate, because I love it. <laughs> It's too cute. So this is the bundle and oh my god, how cute is this pencil case? Like, I mean, we knew I was gonna get this. We just knew, didn't we? I kinda had to. So, I ordered two of these, so I'm just gonna put one to the side just now. So, there is washi, which I will unroll. These are full boxes. I'm excited to see those. So I'll unroll that and insert some footage here. And this is the back to school bundle. Come on camera. So I really like the washi in this. I like these ones with the little scissors, but I love these with the little school stuff. And these are just two of the big washi. So these washi are perforated full boxes. So it's those two and then there's no, no, ooh. Saying work hard. There's a hydrate and a memo. And they are literally perforated washi, which I love. I love these, they are so cute. And that is, there's a lot on there, but that is just adorable. And it's a full box. And from what I remember on the Facebook group, I'm not sure if a regular gel pen would work, but these pens will definitely work, the permanent markers. And I'll try it, but a ballpoint would probably work. It feels like it would. Um, yeah, but. How cute is that? Then there is a pen. Which I can't appear to open. There we go. So there is a pen with Lil on. Let's get the plastic cover off. Ha! Oh my god, that took me like four minutes. Okay, there is a Lil Pen, which, how cute is that, by the way? Love that. I love that it's yellow. There are the bubble stickers. Really like those. Really like them. There's the ruler, which I bought two of these because I really, really like this and, um, I think I might send one to my friend. But yeah, I bought the acrylic ruler. Does it have plastic on? Yes, it does. So let's just spend eight minutes trying to get this plastic off too. Apparently I'm not very good at removing the plastic on things. Oh. Hey, I did it. Look at me, I did it. Okay, I will double check the other side. Does also have plastic? Okay, so here's the ruler. I think it's adorable and I love that it has these little stencil bits for Lil. I love this. So yeah, I did buy two. I'm going to send one to my friend. And then in here, oh, oh, oh I'm excited. <laughs> so this is the pencil case as well. 
they still hold quite a lot I think I might start using that soon for maybe my mild liners it would be quite cool in there so I ordered these grocery stickers separately as well because you could order other things at the same time whoops to have it sent you didn't have to just buy the bundle by itself so I ordered that too and then the rest of the bundle so here's the freebie for September very cute and then you got a monthly planners it's the same as the one that's in the subscription they're both the same inside so you got a mint one and a pink one so now I have three so that'll be October November and December just saying um, <laughs> I'll have a think about what I'm going to use them for. And then the stickers that came with it. So, mistakes are proof that you are trying. That is cute. I love Nono with this little backpack. Oh. Oh, it's a little lunch. Oh my God, that's so cute. Okay, I might be a little bit obsessed. I love the colours. I love the pink and the pastels and super cute. And the lots of washi. Lots of washi. A weekend banner and headers. Date covers. Foiled date covers. These are all on vinyl. These ones are not. These ones are on the mat. Love these. As always. They're always good. Those are really sweet. And then there's the little apple. That is so sweet. And they're all date dots and expressions emojis emojis and then there's the off to school deco uh, seriously dying uh there's the lil study time there's the lil grades let me see there's a b oh there's a b c d and then a tick that's cute there's the school supplies <coughs> <laughs> uh, there's paper clips I love those ones loved them there's the little glasses sorry classes there's the little backpacks not gonna lie kind of want that backpack you know if you would like to make that backpack uh, craft time that's my children covered in tape lab time that would be my children if I allowed them any sort of lab time and then lunch boxes which are adorable adorable and that is the back to school kit yeah I am well impressed well impressed so yeah that's my haul from them I will leave the link down below with the code for some little things thank you so much for the code by the way that's made me ridiculously happy um okay here are the rest of my orders which have arrived in time for me to film and so I am going to just jump right in so I have Bethany Rose's Fiverr Friday from last Friday which was the 11th of September like I say in my haul videos, there will always be a Bethany Rose order because I get her Fiverr Friday every Friday. So there's the thank you card. There is the freebie. It says I am creative, I am blessed, I am loved, I am worthy. I like that. That's really nice. Then there is the gonk. I love the gonk. I'm loving the colours. Very autumnal. There's the functional sheet. There is the little deco and headers and a gonk sticker I think that might be my favourite gonk with the plaits um, then there's the washi strips and then there are the half boxes I very much like this kit the colours are beautiful okay next up all the rest is washi won't lie so it's three washi orders. So this one is from Bloomsicle. I have ordered washi from them before, but it was quite a long time ago. Um, I've just pre-ordered their advent washi as well, which is beautiful. So I love this card. I mean, look at the hollow and the little sticker. 
love the little sticker. So, I know some of this was a set. Let me find my order. Okay, this is the Enchanted Night washi tape. I will unroll it and insert the footage after, but that is the Enchanted Night. So we have Enchanted Night, which I've unrolled two layers of so you could see all of it because I wanted to make sure that I knew what was in there. <laughs> and the moons and the bats and then the date covers. I love this, this set of, this bit of the set in particular, I really love. And then I also got Red Riding Hood, which I really like this. So I will unroll those now and show you what they look like. So there are two other girls, but I didn't unroll the whole thing. I don't know why I needed this whole thing unrolled, but not this. I just, in my head, I remember that, but I wouldn't remember that one. And then the date covers as well. I really, really like all of this. This is probably my least favorite out of the whole set, and I still really love it. I mean, the foil is gorgeous. Okay, then I have two Simply Gilded orders. This one actually didn't get lost, but took a really long time to get here, so I wonder if it got a little bit misplaced in its journey. So, this is the journaling card, which is very pretty. I very much like the flowers and the bow. That's really nice. And then, oh, there is a seal, a bow seal in a sort of taupe. And the freebie. That's very pretty. So then I got, these were oops, definitely oops. So there is... Sage and peach. I can't remember why they were oops, but they were, it says oops on the order. And these are the pink and purple. I think it might be that the bows aren't centered. Um, and that was the plan to have the bows centered, I think. But I'm not sure. But that's, they are definitely listed as oops. So we'll agree that they're oops. I rarely agree that these things are oops, to be fair. They rarely look like oops to me. <laughs> um, then my next order. I love this colour of the card. I love as well that they match. Like, they're pretty. They're very pretty. Um, the seal and another freebie exactly the same as the last one. Okay, so I'm gonna try and get these evened up. Okay, I got the Lilac Sunrise Stardust. Love that. Um, Marshmallow Mint with Black Bow. I really liked these when I saw them. I wasn't gonna buy them, them that's why I bought them separately. From the other order, I'm pretty sure I placed two orders that day. But the black bow just suckered me in. Then I got the lollipop pink and black bow. I got the princess purple and black bow. And I got the trio of pastel goth and black bows. And then I got this one. I don't know why I got this one. Was it a freebie? Maybe? Because I didn't order it. So I'm assuming it was a freebie. It could have been for some reason. I don't know. So yeah, there's that one. I'll need to find out what that one is. Okay. These are the floral floors that are supposed to be oops. I do have other <coughs> floral floors, which are these ones, which I'll be honest, I think, oh, I think I remember now. 
you see the size of the roses there and then compare the size of the roses there and I think that was what the oops was like these roses were bigger than she had wanted them to be I think that was it but I'm not sure I don't really care they look fab <laughs> and the lilac sunrise is beautiful I can't wait to use that and then the mint pink purple and the mixture with the black bows oh my god the black comes out really well they are cool I love those that is my aesthetic right there that is perfect okay so this one which was the I wasn't sure roll is actually a freebie it's actually a freebie so if you ordered on the 28th of August you got a freebie roll and this is the one that I got which is a simple line but it is the um it's actually an unreleased freebie according to Facebook <laughs> so I went into the Facebook group for Simply Gilded somebody else had already asked about this and yeah it turned out it was in a grab bag at some point um but it was actually an unreleased for one that she gave out as a freebie if you ordered on the 28th of august so yeah that's that one okay the last of this week's deliveries i know really just so much stuff okay i'm gonna go with this one i really need to stop spending money guys my no spend has been a disaster so yeah got to get back on that <laughs> so this is Josephine Bow Designs and this is the card which I love whoa love the card this is the August freebie sampler I forgot to use a PR code so didn't get a PR sampler and I got some tabs so I got them on different colorways. There's Dreamer. I got Bubbles. I got the Pink Ombre. I got Mermagical. I got Stargazer. I think I got all the colorways actually. And I got Shine Bright. I'm going to use these with um, reusable Avery tabs so that I can keep using them, not stick them on. I'll show that in another video. I got some date headers, days of the week, paint swatch days of the week in the signature colorway. I very much like this one and this one together. Very pretty. Then I got some acetate and some vellum, so I got pink leopard print vellum. I could have printed myself some pink leopard print vellum, but hey, never mind. Um, some bows. Are they upside down, would you say? Yeah, I'd say they go that way. Yeah. Then this one I think is like supposed to look like snow. I'm sure this was in the Christmas bit. And I got that in vellum and the acetate. I love the acetate. That's gorgeous. And then I also got the snowflake acetate in hollow. Oh yeah, totally getting ready for Christmas here. Apparently. <laughs> then I got another order from the Plump Planner. This I ordered and it arrived within like three days. I was very impressed. Okay, so there's a journaling card, which I've already got this one, but it is really pretty. I might tip that into my Stalogy. And a little note. And then I got these. So I got clean the fridge, because I really need to do that more often. I got go to the post office. I got change toothbrush. 
baking day. Been doing a bit more baking with the children. We did over lockdown and I need to introduce it a bit more with Ben. As one of our homeschool activities, so that was cute. Food shop delivery because I have been trying to get deliveries as well as go to the shop now. I got some small date dots because you can never have enough date dots in my opinion. I got the blank weekly tracker. These are for meals in my Stalogy and for highlights in my cousin. I got two of those. Then I got today's highlight, which I thought was really pretty. I'm not going to use these every day, just if there's something big and the different colorways. I can't remember if these all came as like, I think it was one purchase, but they come on two sheets because they take up a lot of room. And then I got that I'm reading because I am doing a lot more reading lately. And I like that this didn't say I was finished. And I got the social media post tracker. I think these are like one sheet and she cuts it in half so it fits in the envelope to be honest. So I got these. It's got the little Instagram logo on. I'm going to try using these in my Stalogy, I think. To try and help me with my social media posting. Because I'm not very good at remembering to do it. Okay, last up is my September creative kit from Little Rainbow Moon. I pre-ordered this in July. She does pre-orders two months in advance. So on the first of every month, she pre-orders for two months later. So the first of July, pre-order for September's kit. Um, and you do get a discount if you pre-order it in the first 24 hours. Sometimes she does have leftovers. So they're normally available. It'll probably be available now if there are any, to be honest. So I get the full kit and the watercolours. So I'm just going to show you the kit. Wow. Okay, I love. I already love this kit. Look at the feathers. But they're not feathers, the, the leaves, sorry. They're gorgeous. They are gorgeous. I love them. Love those. So these are all collage elements, which is what she lists them as. Okay, there's this piece of art, which a journaling card, which is just beautiful. So then there's some stickers. Sometimes you get date covers, sometimes you don't. These look like large washi strip stickers. Then there is this decorated brown bag. I really like this. This would be nice stuck in like that and then Ooh, I'm getting ideas. Um, then there's this. This is a piece of string mesh. Now she's written on the notes. I loved this find. You could either print with it to create an interesting texture. So press it into acrylic paint and then press onto paper. Or use it as a stencil or a collage with it. That is pretty cool. Ooh, getting ideas. Um, then there is a tissue paper napkin. Oh, it's beautiful. So she... In the notes she's written, I love the contrasting colours on this, imagining little torn up pieces collaged onto a journal spread. I used watered down PVA glue for this. That is a good idea. I love that she does, like tells you the collage elements and then gives you ideas of how to use them. A piece of wallpaper. Oh, that's so nice. I wonder if you could have that as like a fold out. That's really pretty. Um, a beautiful piece of handmade wrapping paper made in Nepal using bark from the Lokta tree. That's gorgeous. Feels lovely. It has that handmade paper feel. I love it. Oh, and then there's a little organza bag of little interesting elements. I'm not going to open this because all these beads and these tiny little pieces will go all over my desk and I'll never find them all, but... Mm. So that's the creative kit portion. Delicious. And then you can choose to add the watercolors on as well. Which I always choose to add the watercolors because that's really the reason I'm getting it, to be honest. I sort of view these pieces as extras for me. I love that it comes in this little tin. So cute. And there we are. Rosewood, Midnight Moss, The Faraway Tree and Bronzed Bark. And it always comes with this little bit of paper for you to watercolor on. I normally cut mine down so that I can stick it in the top here. So I'm going to do that and I will be back once I've opened them all as well. 
Okay, so I've got my cloth and my cup that I use for watercolour, which is Jack Skellington Head, some brushes, and I've cut down my paper. I've got my paints here, and I have, I'm going to try and, there we go, I have dabbed them, I've sprayed them with a little bit of water, just to sort of get them going. Okay, so... This one, first up, is, can you even see, is Rosewood, which is a really beautiful brown. That's really pretty. And then we have bronzed bark. Ooh, oh, no, I never like this one. That one's really nice. I'm gonna move those over, try not to make a big mess. Okay, and then we have the faraway tree. Oh, that is so pretty. <gasps> Okay, I'm kind of loving the faraway tree. That green. Oh yeah, that's gorgeous. Okay, and then Midnight Moss. That's beautiful. That's a really deep green. That is really nice. So I'm gonna let them dry and then I will show you them. <clears throat> That's me stuck them back in the tin. They have little magnets on the bottom of the pans to hold them in the tin. And then I've stuck the watercolor card just with some double-sided tape. And that is the beautiful colors. I love Midnight Moss and Faraway Tree. I actually love them all, but I think Midnight Moss and Rosewood will go together so beautifully in a wintry autumn sort of way oh i love these ones i love them so i will leave links down below to everything i've mentioned in this very large combined haul um if anyone has any questions please ask them down below or you can find me on instagram i'll put my instagram name just here and as always thank you so much for watching and uh thank you for watching all of this stuff uh and i will catch you next time bye